to forget all of the great things you did. When did I fall away? Faith for the impossible. How did I start to believe you were sufficient for me? Why do I talk myself out of seeing?
does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip. He who watches over you will not slumber. Indeed, he who watches over Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun will not harm you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all harm. He will watch over your life. The Lord will watch over your coming and your going both now and forevermore. I lift my eyes up to the mountains. There's two ways of looking at that, and I want to look at it a little differently this morning. Last week we talked about mountains that are the situations, things that we're facing that are seemingly impossible, immovable, improbable to change. And we're in this time of prayer and fasting, and we're saying, God, would you move? We're asking again. We're coming boldly before your throne of grace. So I want you to think right now for, for the next couple of moments about some situations, maybe in your personal life, maybe in your family, maybe in your physical body, maybe in the life of someone that is close to you that seems impossible, improbable, and immovable. Take 30 seconds and think about that for a moment. Just close your eyes for a moment. We're gonna pray together in a moment, but I wanna give some context. So just take a moment. And I want you to think about that situation. And with the psalmist say, where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord. Is there anybody that has a situation like we've described or someone in your life does? Just put your hand up all around the room. We're gonna pray. Impossible, improbable, immovable, apart from the Lord. So we're gonna turn this into one giant prayer room for the next couple of minutes, all together, all at once. If you don't, particular, if your hand's not up, maybe you wanna lay your hand on the shoulder of someone else and pray with them. But let's all together come and say, where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord. So let's begin to pray as loudly as you just were singing just a moment ago, all together, all at once. God can sort it out. of the Spirit of God in the, in the people of God. We need to see things shift. We need to see so many things change. But it's not by our might. It's not by our power. It's by the Spirit of the Lord. I lift my eyes up to the mountains. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, 
the maker of heaven. I lift my eyes up to the mountain. Where does Canada's help come from? Our help comes from the Lord. So I'm going to ask some of you to turn. I do this sometimes, just something I do. Some of you to turn that way and, and prophetically we're going to pray over our nation. Some of you are going to turn that way and we're going to pray over our nation. Some of you are going to turn that way and some of you are just going to keep praying this way. Can we do that? Just take a little step and we're going to pray for our nation. Pray that there would be a move of the Spirit of God. Pray that families would be restored. Pray for the restoration of marriages. Pray for things in the educational realm. Pray for things in the political realm. Pray for things in the entertainment world. God, that your kingdom would come and your will would be done on earth as it is in heaven. Our help comes from the Lord. Lord Jesus, we have so much need. We have so much chaos. Lord, our help comes from you. All together, all at once, the same way you were just praying nice and loud. say that line, anything is possible, I want you to insert that word in there. It might be restoration that you're believing God for. Restoration is possible. It might be healing. Healing is possible. It might be salvation is possible. It might be freedom is possible. It, do you get the, everybody get the picture for a moment? But let's begin to pray that out. Anything is possible. Not just anything. The, the mountain that you're talking about right now, that God has spoken to you about, that seems to be held up, blocked up, stopped up, anything is possible. We'll go back into that. Anything, and then I'm going to be off here.
Jesus, we thank you that we can lift up our eyes to our mountains, even though we might say, where does our help come from? We agree with you that our help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth, and anything is possible. Thank you, Lord, that we're not limited by our ability, our background, our how well we're doing, how well we're not doing. We lift our eyes to you. Thank you, Lord, that Psalm 97 reminds us that the mountains melt like wax at the presence of the Lord. So we bring it before you and say, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. In the strong name of Jesus, and everyone said, amen, amen and amen.